Hello everyone, Basic Ollie here, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to another stream. So far, so good. All is calm, and all is right with the world, and so far, it's been going very well, and the stream is working as it should. Huzzah, I think we've finally done it. Now, there have been two changes to the stream. I'd love you to tell me, chat, if you could tell me exactly um, what they are. If you could tell me what they are, very, very well spotted, I'd say. Right, let's just turn the audio on. Boom, there we go. But uh, yeah, hopefully that's coming through all clear for you. And uh, yeah. <sighs> I'm, I'm praying. I am praying this does not. This does not. Um, <laughs> go, go bang. Okay. Two, you've spotted basically straight away. So I'll tell you exactly. I'll show you exactly what it is, chat. So... You can't see, but in the bottom left-hand corner, I think you can just about see my mouse. See, it's got my exact steering wheel now. So that's got my exact steering wheel. So my steering inputs, you'll see exactly what I'm doing uh, by a little uh, graph on there. Uh, and the other change I've made is I've swapped the camera around, so I've, I've flipped horizontally. So um, I'm hoping it looks better. It just means so that when I'm, you know, steering like this, um, the guy in the car is also doing the same, you know. I'm not going left whilst the guy in the car is going right if that makes sense so i'm hoping that'll make a little it's a little change but you know it, it is what it is but welcome um two races for you today uh we've got a vrs sprint which is 40 minutes um and then we are going back to spa because me and josh are doing a six hour on saturday uh, it'll be an early start that one uh, i believe it's 8 a.m but uh yeah we're doing a six hour on saturday and we're in the lmp2 for that so we're going to do another hour race at spa we're going to be in the lmp2 this time uh, and then we might do a third race, depending on the times and, and how we've gone, essentially. But we're back in the Audi R8 for this one. Um, I absolutely love the Audi R8. Um, so basically, BOP, so new for this season. Uh, the Audi has lost five kilos. Um, so it's just a little bit nicer to drive. And when you go on VRS, like I showed you guys uh, on the previous stream, um, it shows you all the times of all the cars. And the BOP this season is very, very good. So all the cars are very, very close. They're all within a tenth at this track. All the cars are within a tenth of a second. Looks really good. Wow, look at that. <laughs> Thank you, Wolfie. And remember for seven months, that's new. That's popped up. Thank you, Wolfie. Advanced fan. New YouTube mechanic to annoy you. <laughs> Morally happy seven months. Babe. Thank you so much, dude. Love it. So... Uh, yeah, thank you very much. Two other things as well. I thought I, I, I thought uh, <laughs> thought I'd show you guys. Sorry. Um, you know I um I got a bit upset, shall we say, after my recent stream issue. So I've I've I, my keyboard did not survive too well. Um, so I bought myself. I thought it's payday. I'm actually going to treat myself to something nice. So here we have a look at this. This is a mechanical keyboard. So if I I don't really want to tap in case I cancel something somehow. That's my luck at the moment. But it's a very, very nice uh, mechanical keyboard. So that lights up. Looks really cool. Um, you can also have splash effects as well. So as soon as you press H, all the other lights around it light up. But that is a very, very nice keyboard. Uh, and I got myself a new uh, fancy mouse as well. So, uh, yeah, I thought I'd upgrade those bits and bobs because they um, need upgrading. They're, they're, a little bit, uh, they're a little bit rubbish, to be fair. So, um, yeah, proper smart. Really, really... Really, really happy with that. So, uh, yeah, anyways, enough of me talking bollocks, as always. Um, let's go and do some racing, shall we? Let's go do it. Nah, nah, nah. Stuart, we're fine, mate. We're good. We're good now, buddy. Well, I say that. Um, if I, I just I just want... Um, uh, Corsair is the brand donut. Um, I just want a faultless stream. I just want a stream where nothing goes wrong. That's all I want. I don't, uh, the racing, I don't mind too much. It's strange to say. I obviously want a good result, but I don't want anything to go wrong stream-wise. Uh, yeah, so we are in the Audi for this one. Let me know if it's too loud or too quiet. Yeah, uh, it wasn't. I didn't kill the whole keyboard. I killed the space bar, Steve. Exit's clear. Don't cross the white line. P24. So I, I killed the key, I killed the keyboard. So it was just not working. Um, space bar, sorry. The mighty, thank you for the tin. He was saying to ease the stress and pain last days. Good luck and have fun tonight. Thank you, mate. Thank you, mighty. Appreciate that, dude. I just want everything to work. That's all I want. Um, I want to thank the Discord as well because I spent like an hour trying to, you know, fix it. And it's good. And 
and uh, yeah, they, they help me out, try and diagnose it. Um, basically, what we've done is we've gone from one piece of software to another. Damn, son, where'd you find this? So we're normally, uh, we're normally on uh, Streamlabs. This time we're streaming from OBS instead. And so far, so good. Audio's a tad louder than me. Okay, no worries, I can change that. Bear with me. Da -da 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 -da. Nice and easy. It's honestly, it's very easy to have to say. I just... Right, then we'll try that. Bear with me. There's a car approaching. Don't cross the white line. How's that? Still too loud? I can turn it down a little bit more if you want me to. We've got minus five. So I'll get I'll give you an example. That's that's minus five. And then I'll put it on a bit of minus ten. So that's minus ten. So which out of the two do you prefer? Uh, track wise we're at twin ring Mategi for the first one. So this is, you've probably not seen this track since me, Rory and Kirif did a, a six hour here in the Porsche GT, if you guys remember that, back in the day. Minus five. Okay. Cool. Right, I will go back to minus five. Probably should have stopped on the racing line there. Right. That's minus five. If you're happy with that, let me know and we will stick with it. And remember, we can do all the sort of customizing in the world. You know, we'll make it absolutely perfect. Just got to tell me what you want. Love this track. Beautiful players, memory saves me, uh, serves me well. Yeah, I like. I've got to be honest. For like GT4, right? Like GT4 and stuff. Um, I don't really like remember doing many races here. I remember doing the. Uh, the I think there's a license test in the Merc that we did. But I don't really remember ever racing here, to be honest. Missing Ducky. Oh, we'll get. We'll, ducky. we'll get that. I haven't raced it too much. Doesn't mean we can't get a good result. We'll see what we can do. You know, VRS is always um, more difficult though, I find. I feel a lot, a lot more people play VRS. So the time, the time you see at the top is my quality time. So we're just in race room right now, just getting some laps in. Oh, feels good though. Sounds good. Hey, Carl. No worries, mate. Are the race here in MotoGP today? I suppose you got it on your career, mate. That's pretty. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's, it's. Do you know what? It's not the most. It's not the most popular track on iRacing, but I have to say, I really do. I enjoy racing around it. I might not be the quickest here, but I enjoy racing around it. Hello. Mr. M Mr. Abraham, how are you? Thanks for joining me. Yeah, we're going against the um, what I normally do in the Beamer. I'm going to go. I'm going to go in the Audi. Um, I fancy driving an MR car. I love the sound of this thing, you know. Um, and I, f I fancy driving something different, you know. So yeah. Is it intended we only see a bit or anything? Oh, <laughs> I'll tell you why. Um, because that's literally just behind the overlay, mate. It's not um, It's not intentional. It's just where the overlay sits. Um, normally, I don't have that up, so you won't see it. So, yeah. That's all. Um, 
Honestly, Wolfie, it depends on the track. It really does depend on the track. Uh, with a new tyre model, I might be aiming more towards MR, but it would be... Um, I think Audi might be my favourite MR car, you know? Sounds like a Hoover sister. Really? Normally, a lot of people like the sound of the Audi. I can understand what you mean, though. Sh yeah, it's a shame. Layout usually makes for good racing. Lots of track. Absolutely. Um, good track. I've never, I've never raced the oval here. Um, so that'd be weird. Seeing that. I don't know if you can do it on this game. I assume you could. Ollie's looking the wrong way to read chat. Well, this is the way I look to read chat. This is the way I look to read chat. Um, I could swap it back if you want. It's literally just a, you know, so my steering's the same as what the car's doing. I can change it back. It doesn't, it doesn't matter, you know. Um, down to preference, really. Evolve. I got my first supply with that. Mate, nice. GG. GG, buddy. First supply with very nice. Uh, the Doom. Gosling, hello, mate. Thanks for joining me. Ollie gets excited about German engineering. German, German engineering is amazing. I don't, I don't know, I don't understand how people can't like German cars. I don't, I honestly, like, Volks, Volkswagen, Porsche, BMW, like, pff, Audi, like, how can you, I don't understand how you can't not like a single one of those brands. They've got some amazing cars, you know. Um, German engineering is brilliant. Mercedes, it's absolutely fantastic. They're right up there. German engineering is the best. You live in Germany, nice evolved. I've never been to Germany. I'd like to go one day. But I'm one of those people I get homesick very quickly. So I would be like, oh, Germany's cool. And after four hours, like, I want to go home. <laughs> it doesn't matter where I am. It's, that's how I've always been. I don't, I don't like being away for too long. I, I, like, my, I like my space. I, I like this, you know? The track temperature's decreasing. It's now 19 Celsius. Also, it's, I think, again, I racing, like, even though it's um, nice and bright, it is 7 a.m., so track temp should be good. Uh, and it's qu it's quite, um, maybe, the, I think it's in Japan, Motegi. I don't know what the, um, I don't know what the kind of, like, temperature is there. Is there kind of, like, almost winter time? I don't know. I don't know. To be honest. So I spa this weekend. I think it's going to be. I think the temps are going to be cold, even though we'll be racing between like um you know not eight and two a.m. or whatever, or two p.m. Sorry. Um, I think temperature wise we should be fine. Right. Okay. I'm going to stress myself out too much for this one. I just all I want is a good race. You know? Two laps to get the job done. Positions are relevant at the moment. I just want a good race. And fly. Yeah, 90 degrees, nice and cold. Steering will I be? I feel is a bit redundant. Okay, no worries. Let us know what you think. Again, these overlays I've got them all. So if you want me to, if you prefer not to have it, or you, you know, it's not, you don't really look at it at all. Just let me know. It's all good. Okay. The only place I feel like I'm really struggling on circuits here is so difficult. Race the F1 cars that we got released on iRace, absolutely great. So if anyone didn't know, iRacing's teamed up with the Mercedes 
uh, F1 team and they're going to be releasing um, some Mercedes racing cars is what they've said so it looks like we're going to get a Mercedes F1 car on iRacing probably won't just be F1 cars though a few GT cars maybe Up updated AMG GT3 Uh, strength of feel, please, chat. Not too early on the phone. Two point three. Thank you. Right, we touched it. That is one. Okay, cool. Might miss the apex here. Maybe a high forty eight, maybe. Too hot into that. Shame, lost some time there. So far, so good. Is that going to be enough for pole? That, that's... The leader has just done a 148.8. Oh! No! Look how close that is, chat. Oh! Fair play, Joe. Oh, that's close. <laughs> that is close. We'll take that. We'll take a P2. We'll just find higher up the grid. Less likely they are to have issues during the race anyways. There we go, chat. So far, so good, man. So far, so good. Really, really happy this is uh, working as it should. Good old OBS, man. Dreamlabs can get in the bin. Woo! Huzzah! Nice race this livery as well. I really like this kind of white, black and grey livery. Uh, green, I should say. Okay. Put the race set up on. Boom. Right, we've got 48 seconds, but I think we're good. It's weird, the strength of field is so low. Well, I'm 2.6k now. I lost 200 I rating on the previous stream, so... It might be that. Um, I'm ranked 5, I think, in here. 
Um, there's 25 cars in this split. Uh, and I'm, I'm number five, I think. So, let's have a... Oh, that's the wrong thing. Hang on. Uh, back to normal. Oh. Yeah, what is the strength field? Yeah, 2.3k. So, someone... The guy who out-qualified me is in, in a Porsche. 2.7... And then Audi behind me in 2.7 as well. So we're up there with where we should be, I think. We're up there. You know? They're all very similar. That's the end of the session. P2. There you go. End of that. P2 chat. Very, very, very happy with that. 200 big drop. Um, I suppose uh, 200 in probably GT Sport terms is probably 5,000 driver rating, fine, I'd say. Hey, nice work, David, man. Nice work. Two, the first 2K is a big one. Well done, mate. Well done. Thanks, everyone, for joining. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Let's do it. Looking forward to this. Oh, I've just realised what I haven't got. You know what? I've just realised what I haven't got. How much time have I got? I haven't got fuel chat. Let's see if we can quickly add fuel. Bear with me. Uh, race labs. I haven't got the fuel thing. Uh, overlays. Where the hell is the fuel? Calculator. Info. Do do do. Cool. Oh, look at that. He's only gone and bloody added it before the start of the bloody race chat. Jeez. Pro streamer. There you go, chat. Cool. Right, I've, I've topped that down to 30 litres already. You know. Take the tyres off. P2, the track temp is 19 Celsius. Have a clean eye, say, send it on turmoil. Joe, she's got the inside and we've got that awkward kind of uh, chicane. Only thing I would Follow say. Follow the safety car in the right column. <laughs> Thank you, Stuart. Damn, Thank you, mate. Son, you find this? <laughs> I can't promise anything, mate. Can't promise. Okay, Oliver, get ready. They got had to cut across straight away to stop that Audi trying to make a move on me there. Floor it, green, green, green. No, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. We're good, we're good, we're good. Fuck. Cold tyres. That absolutely killed me. So it's good, we're good, we're good. Car's not gone. That's the name. Oh, hello. Fine, it's fine. I, all I said was I just want a clean race. It's fine. I don't care. Honestly, I just, I just want to have a clean race. I don't care. I just did not want to hit that wall, man. I just did not want to hit that wall. It's all good. So right, we'll make our way back at this. We've got the pace for it, it's fine. That rear just gave up on me, didn't it? Push too much. 
a little bit eager. Hey, Bernios. We know we got the pace on these guys around us, right? We were good enough to start P2. What, like 40 minutes? If that's the worst thing that's going to happen in this stream, I'll be absolutely chuffed. Be positive, Ollie, today. Take all that negativity away. Oh, Lars is in here. <laughs> Did he realise? Hello, Lars, mate. Lars is in this bloody race. Put too much steering input there. Too much steering angle. Right, chat, if you wouldn't mind, you'll have to keep me updated with the lap times up ahead. The leader has just done a Someone else has died. That's one. Four nine fifty. Thank you, mate. I can break later there. Play 49s for the leaders. Nice work on that then. Six ahead of 50 51. Thank you. The gap behind us now, 1.1. Yellow flag. On the yellow. Fastest lap for Juice, 148.83. Bad lap time, but we can get we can do better than that. P22, that lap was at 149.69. That's your best lap in this session. Everyone. 
Thank you for the updates, chat. I haven't done the info, no. <laughs> uh, we were, before the stream, I was around um, Chloe's parents. We went there for the last barbecue of the year kind of thing. I had a chance to update that. Two temps up at the start of that. Lost it a little bit. Okay, Oliver, gaining on this car. The gap is 1.0. Just done a that Jim oh a wide entry there that's a bit of time oh race lab delivery all right we're there boys and girls up time on Iris. It's not much, there's not so much time, Stuart. It's more, um, it's more to do with distance, I think, than time, to be honest. But generally, I think generally the rule is around 1.23 seconds normally. But it's quite weak. I mean, normally when you're within a second, it's quite good. Cheers, Philip. I think my goal is to try and get back in the top 10. See Lars is behind me. That's my scariest corner for a bend it. It was a bit floaty. See the apex there. Yeah, I was seven steps slower that lap. It's because I um, had that awkward to deal with that Porsche. I think I was coming back on around here. Oh! Yellow flag, keep your wits about you. guys. They've all done well to avoid that. What's with um, cars end up sideways or backwards in this one? I think this guy, Eric, in front of us is not too bad. Okay, Oliver, keep it nice and smooth. Come on, let the race come to us. V19, that was a 150.90. 
Got to get a run on him. I think he's faster than the guys up here as well. Oh, he's gone. Go right, go right, go right. Oh, my. <laughs> oh, that so easily could have been us. If we'd overtaken him, that would have been us. Oh, that sucks for him. Oh, man. I don't know if that Lambo put his brakes on fully. He seemed to roll a little bit. We can check it afterwards. Thank you, Wolfie, for the five! Spring <laughs> stream sponsored by Charmin Ultrasoft. <laughs> Keep the brown flag moments just moments. Yes, absolutely. Damn, son, where'd you find get tight to that apex? Losing time there. Thank you, Wolfie, again. P16's in the pits. Your apexes. Wait for the chances to come, mate. B17. I will do, Jim. I'll do my best. Time to drop it off. Come on, you can do better than this. Come on, Jim. Oh, you're just praising me then. This guy's slow. Try and go for the attack on the straight. I'm only surprised they feels quite quick on the straight. I wasn't expecting that. Hey, hey, Mikey. Yeah, yeah. I'll mention that at the start. This is one of uh, Team Rock's first. Wasn't the first, but it was right up there with one of our earlier stuff. Oh, I wasn't good enough in the exit there. Gotta get past this guy. Let me have it. Left. B16. Thank you, mate. Well done, Oliver. Nice move, mate. Okay. What kind of times are Marco doing, please, chat? I don't really in front of me. Marco. I think it's Moreno. Please and thank you. Pace is pretty rubbish behind the beyond the beamer, so we should be able to catch him. I feel already, jeez. Gap to Maya behind is increasing. Thank you. Zero seconds. I think I'm breaking too early for that one again. Mm -hmm. 
Head up. The 13's in. Okay, Oliver. Come on, stay focused. Apexes and exits. Apexes and exits. 15th place. Watch that, Jim. A laps remaining. Thank you. Nice for that. Good lap so far. A little bit too tight there. Gotta be braver on the brakes here. Braver on the brakes. I thought that was better. Yeah, that is better. There we go. Hey, Bill. All right, Oliver. The next car is Moreno. for this one chap. Hey X. I'd like to think that's the fastest lap of the race. Everyone. 48 8 is the fastest. Okay. We'll see if we can beat that. Close. That's 20 minutes to go. 20 minutes. We're halfway home. We estimate 11 minutes of fuel remaining. We feel 22 at the moment. Thank you. Well, that was a bit rubbish. Race pace. Yellow flag. Oh, where's that? Where's that? Oh, got out of the way, thankfully. Can't one this car to deal with. P11 as well, that was. So you'll notice the fuel will go up and down every now and then. It's all to do with where the game thinks the white flag's going to be. Now, 
with this is trying to get both past both of them. Don't know if I can save enough fuel for an extra lap. How much it would really benefit me. I think I was aware then. Very early on the brakes. Both of them. No tyre change now, just fuel on this one. 14th. Get the lap time, just drop immediately as soon as you get in traffic. Jim, please! Jim is like one of those very over enthusiastic dads. I'm like super proud of his son. God, blimey. In the back of him there. Use all the track, force him to find the gap. Tim's had a couple of gimmicks. He certainly has. Ah, he's living a dream, though, isn't Nice racing, Brad. Thank you very much. Really good, respectful racing, that. Got a bit of clean air now. Low fuel. Not sure how the tyres are going to be. We'll see how close we can get to Jeffrey here before we have to pit. Brad's in the pit. The gap in front is now 3.7 seconds. E11. That lap time was 150.38. We estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. Okay, Jim. The gap to Moreno behind is increasing. It's now 1.5 seconds. Good. 
Whoa! -ho -ho -ho! She knew he went there. Where's the brown flag? Wolfie, I know you love your brown flag, mate. Get that one out. Wave your brown flag. I should have to maybe make an emoji for that. Or an emote. And when we come out of the pits, we aren't going to be in the same position because I think quite a few people decide to go for the, uh, the dramatic undercut. Let's get some clean air. The car ahead's pitting now. Your lap time was 149.74. Sector 3 is 0 0.28 off the pace. Okay, I'm going to have to be in this lap. Left. In this lap, in this lap. Uh, can't quite read that, Michael. It's a little bit too long, mate. Whilst I'm racing, sorry dude. Talking about GT7 starting from scratch. Oh yeah, we'll have to start from scratch. We don't want to... I wouldn't want my rating carried over from GT Sport, to be honest, Michael. I'm quite happy to um, start again. What's the point of getting a new game if it's just going to be the same rating as you were in the previous one? You've got to start from scratch again. My opinion, anyways. Okay, I've got 23 litres. What's everyone saying fuel-wise, please? Still 21.8? Okay, Oliver. We're running on fumes, mate. Hit this lap. In this lap. The lead car's pitting. Guys, are unchecked yet? 21.6. Oh. So I'll up that to 22. What an awkward pit entry this is. Pit lane speed limit is 60 kilometers per hour. Box in 270 meters. The car behind's pitting. 100 meters. 50 meters. Come on. 10 minutes to go. That's 10 minutes left. Get it. Watch your mirrors, there's a car approaching. V12. It's a tire wear. More than I expected, to be fair. 15%. P10 is 4.7 seconds ahead. Our objective was to try and get back in the top 10. So let's just see how close we can get to it, shall we? Uh, but as I have to say, the fuel for race labs has always been very good for me, I have to say. The leader, Juice, is pitting. Uh, there's other people in the pits. We may in a position or two. We'll have to see. The gap in front is now 0.9. Cars is in. Take it, Emily. That's 
Lars. We're going to go past him now. He's really not liking that beamer, is he? That was understeer like crazy. Right, P12. 3.4 seconds off P10. No taking out of Lars. He's safe from me. Thank you, mate. Okay, Oliver, you've got 10 minutes of fuel remaining. It's been some very good, respectful good racing in this race. It's been really good. I don't know what car Lara's in, actually. I imagine he's going to be in the BMW. Sorry, the info's out of date. Explanation <laughs> mark info is out of date, I'm afraid. <laughs> I didn't know what I was going to end up doing, so I didn't update it. P11. I think we'll do VRS and ESS by looks of it. All right, come on, chat. 2.7. We've got five minutes left. Well, six minutes, really. Nice. He's in a Ford. Oh, fair play. Again, Ford's a good car here. All the cars here, like I said at the start of the stream. All extremely even on base. Which is awesome Gap to see. Lines increased to 5 minutes to go, 5 minutes, come on, no more mistakes, concentrate. Alright Jim, bloody hell, I'm Oh, the, the, the physics are um, much more improved in this game compared to GT Sport. Uh, okay. Carmival. Sorry, mate. I can't quite read the grass and racing. Oh, well, they're fighting, boys and girls. They're fighting. Okay, Oliver. You're reeling. Lord, in. The gap's now 0.9. Even though I made a mistake on turn four, I say I do love this car, man.
could get a bit feisty. Hey, Vincent. Car left. Still there. Clear left. Oh, just about got it. Great move. Keep it up. Cut across his nose a little bit. Lives fine another day. Tenth position. That was a one fifty point one six. It's way too tight there. Oh, that's P ten. It's now 22 Celsius. Two minutes to go, two minutes. Five minutes of fuel remaining, five minutes. Oh, should I break into corners if I can try then? I'm going to do ESS after this, yes Lord, yeah. I think next lap's white flag. There it is. One more to go. Very little fuel left. Left side. Still there. Clear left. Car right. Oh. Right side. So clear right. Car right. Hold your line. Right side's clear. Good man. He let me through. Thank you. That's top bloke. Top bloke there. Alright, Clay. We're running on fumes, mate. Good recovery job, I think. Michelle is now in the lead. Cross the line, then, boys and girls. We'll take a P9, 100%. Really, really good recovery in the end. E9, there's the checker flag. I mean, considering where we were, we'll we will 100% take a P9. There's no doubt in my mind after that. No doubt in my mind. Lots of undercuts there. Lots of undercuts, but yeah. I think this honestly just makes me want to drive the Audi a little bit more. I might use the Audi a lot for the VRS Sprint Series or whatnot. Um, there is also a, a division. There's like a championship every season. And I'm currently in Division 2 um, out of 5. So I will keep you guys updated with how that's going as well. Because every race we get championship points. And depending on when we finish and what split. So I'll keep you updated with how we're doing. 
uh, every couple of weeks in a championship, you know? Because it's not just races. You do get championship points, and then at the end, you get be crowned champion or whatnot. So we'll keep an eye on that. We will keep an eye on that. Yeah, cheers, everyone. Uh, we'll save the replay. It's going to go blank now because it's going to have to load the other sim, but don't worry. Uh, it's just because it's um, I'm loading into ESS now, so don't worry about it too much. Um, European Sprint Series, here we go. Uh, I've literally only had like three, four laps in this thing. This this race is more um, to get ourselves ready for Spa. Liam P10 had 12 overtakes. Nice. Cracking job then. Really, really good job. Is GT Sport working as a tentative? I haven't tried it, EX, but I, th I would imagine it is. I would imagine it is. You want to see Ducky? Hang on. Let me see if I can get Ducky for you, chat. Bear with me. Da -da -da -da. Where is Ducky? There you go. Ducky's there. Oh, do you know what? I have to say, the, the relief, honestly, the relief, the fact that this is working is... The stress, honestly, the stress. You have no idea, chat. I was literally losing sleep. Just trying to figure out what the hell was going wrong. The worst thing is, like, you know, I work on computers for a living, and even I couldn't figure it out, and it was just killing me. It was absolutely killing me. In the end, we had to just give up on Streamlabs and go to OBS, but uh, if anything, I think OBS works so much better. So much better. So, fingers crossed, this will be the end of any of our issues. Oh, nice, then. Well, best of luck with that, mate. And, uh, keep us updated. Uh, in the Discord and stuff. Absolutely. I'd love to know how you get on. Uh, Indy, no, I'm on the... Um, I'm not on the DD one. I am on the CSL DD. I'm on the 350 euro one. So, you know. No sleep for 17 keyboards later. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Wondering why I didn't use OBS from the start. I'll tell you why. For any streamers out there, I used, I used OBS at the start, but I used Streamlabs, right? Because with Streamlabs, you don't have to put the YouTube stream key in. All right. Um, and that was it. And, oh, and you can, do you know the, do you know the thing I normally have on the screen where it says uh, the last three people who have donated or became members or subscribed? That, that's not, that doesn't appear. That's not in OBS. I can't have that. But I would far sacrifice that stuff and then have everything work 100% of the time, all the time, you know? So that's what I'd rather have. Hello, Santos. How are we? Uh, Phil with the CSL DD, it's, a, it's a f amazing. Every time I have to go on Gran Turismo, uh, I'm kind of sad in a way the fact that I have to um, have to switch to the CSL Elite, you know? Um, as soon as there's a PlayStation version, I'll be asking Fanatec to, to send me one if they can. Um, yeah, I'd love one. Also, I've, I've said it many times, I really want to get hold of their Porsche wheel as well. I just think that's great. I don't know. The Mighty, I tried looking for it, but I couldn't find it. Uh, if you have this on OBS, Holly, if you use stream elements and create or use an existing one, I have to see if I can set it up. But I didn't see it. Uh, I have to... Uh, so you guys tell me you can, okay? I'll have to check it. The track temperature is falling. I don't know it's if there's a difference between OBS and OBS Celsius. Studio. Um... Mine's just OBS. I didn't know there was a I didn't know there was a difference between them. I know. I know. The thing is, with the events thing, I I thought yes, it's going to be a browser source, but I didn't see the setting on the Streamlabs web page for me to add it as an event as a browser source. So, may have the fuel a bit bigger. Yeah, sure, 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 sure. Hang on, bear with me. How's the sound of that? Was all good that race? I assume it was. Oh, ducky out of the way. <laughs> right, let me make uh, the fuel a little bit bigger. Uh, how's that? Do you want it a little bit bigger or are you happy with that, chat? Let me know if that's, um... Let me know if that's a good enough size. Oh, you have to wait till it loads again. What I need to do, do you know, like, um, if you watch Jimmy Broadbrench streams, which I'm sure you all have, um, when his stuff's loading, he has, like, a cursed image in the background. So I may have to have, like, an image in the background when things are loading, it's a black screen. I may have to find like a really bad picture of myself and put it as a background. Who's in the iRacing racing team for the weekend, Ollie? Uh, it's just me and Josh, Dirt. It's just me and Josh. I would love 
I would love to do the... Uh, what I'd love to do... Um, I would love to do the six-hour, which I'm doing, uh, spa. So do a six-hour spa Saturday morning. But I'd also love... I'd also love to do the three-hour of what you've just watched on Saturday at 8 p.m. as well. But <laughs> and sadly, I can't find anyone to do it with. I can't find anyone to do it with. So I'll keep you posted. I'll keep you posted. Everyone in BRT is already busy. Um, so I'll keep you posted on that. No worries, Tracy. Never apologise. Sean says £65 for GC7 to pre-order on PS5. Fucking hell. Sean, <laughs> let me tell you, I got the digital deluxe um, version, which, by the way, I have to say is a little bit of a con. Um, and it cost me £90 on the PlayStation Store. £90. And if you pre-order it on the PlayStation Store... Um, you have to, you have to pay for it right away. What about Callum? I haven't heard anything from Callum. I put it in the BRT chat. I may ask him. I may ask him. But I put it in our, like, Discord, and, um, no one was available, so. I kind of find it weird if, if, they, if I've asked and they've not said it, and they've not said yes, I feel a bit weird then i send them a single message and say, oh, did you see it? Like, I feel a bit weird. Because, you know, it's just weird, isn't it? Three hours, I would honestly, Ingo, if it, if I could do it solo, I would, I think. Yeah. Uh, we are doing a six-hour spa this Saturday. You're more than welcome to join. Thank you, Lord, but um, it's the three hour I'll be looking at. 80 quid for fours of five. Now, fours of rise of five. Now, I feel like that takes a mick. Um, the reason... I am a bit of a madman, Sean, but the reason I am... It's because, for me, I know it's a lot of money. Don't get me wrong, it's a lot of money, right? But it's not like FIFA, is it? It's not like FIFA or Call of Duty where a new one comes out every year. It's now 22 Celsius. It literally comes out every four years and is delayed like two or three times. So I thought, let's just go for it and get the best version. Um, and, and just go from there. It preloads two weeks before the game's released. So it will download on my console two weeks before it's released. Um, and we'll go from there. Oh, magic! Me and Rory cleared the air, mate. We were talking today, dude. Um, I actually, <laughs> I asked him if he wanted to do the free hour, but he said he was um, busy. Um, he's got two kids now, and he cut, literally he hasn't got a spare time. So we're organised. We're going to see if we can sort some stuff out for next year. Um, we can't do anything this year. He just doesn't have the time. So don't you worry, magic. Me and Rory are all good, mate. Pit lane speed limit is 60 kilometers per hour. Exit's clear. Push. We've got two laps to set a decent time. Okay. So what do you get extra with the base game for GT7? Um, you get in-game credits, PlayStation avatars, uh, and a load of cars, I think. I say a load of cars, like three or four. I don't think it's many. Yeah, Lars. Uh, best of luck in this one, mate. I hope we're in... Are we in the same split? We should be. The track temperature's decreasing. It's now 22 Celsius. Uh, it'll be, I'm, it's going to be one of those ones where I think I'm going to be a little bit slow at the start. And as the race goes on, I should get more up to pace. Lots of people enjoy the sound of the... LMP2. I've always enjoyed it, but I think lots of people love the sound of LMP2. Uh, Forza Horizon, uh, for me, I enjoy playing them, but I don't have a very, like, I can't keep, you know, I'll play like five, ten hours, and then I'll, then I'll kind of not be interested too much anymore. I don't really feel like they've changed it much at all since the first and second one. Thank you, Fig Mick, for the 750. That sells my place it a year ago, mate. I'll try and read that as soon as I can. Ah, oh, thank you, Figmig. Well, I'm glad. That's really awesome to hear that you're getting another rig, man. How 
I'd like to get a good X out of there last time. Oh, that feels difficult to get good out of X out there. Son, where'd you find this? Day in LMP2 at Spa is a lot of fun. Doesn't matter if it was just a place he challenged, mate. Not just a place he challenged, it was your place he challenged, dude. I'm sad they had to let it go. But glad to hear you're getting it back, mate, or getting another one. That's awesome. Hey Ray, how you feel as well? Thanks for joining as always. Oh Ollie, that was wide mate. Oh good lap this one. Hey Gavin, hurry up as well. Now we'll, um, for Forza Horizon 5, we'll definitely get it, we'll definitely get it, oh yeah. We'll definitely do a few streams on it, I think. I'm way too early on the brakes as well. A oh, bit naff that. Right, the second one's got to be better. 203, ooh. Oh. Last lap time was at 203.40. Come on, we can do way better than that, mate. Better. Woo. On the edge, baby. I'm, hoping, I'm praying it's just you, Sean, to be honest. Scared the crap out of me there. <laughs> the leader has just done a 201.77. My best is a 201.8. The leader's just done a 201.55. Okay, it's an improvement. It's a 2023. It's still not good, but it, it, you know, we're not last. The Lars ended up doing it. What did Lars do? 2019. Well, best is 2018, so that would put us like P3 or 4, I think. Let's put the Spa race up on. Okay, looks like we're going to have to make our way through the field then in this one. Ooh. Oh, we've got LMP1, 2, and GTEs. Ooh la la, chat. Ooh la la. Awesome. 11, 12, 14 LMP2s by the looks of it. 11 GTEs. And uh, 8 LMP1s. Okay. Predictions then, chat. I'm going to quickly get a drink, but get your predictions in, please.
That's the end of the session. P10. Cool. How long is this race? Is an hour, this one. Yeah, this is an hour race. Right. So, fuel. How are we happy with the size of the fuel? We can make it bigger if you want, chat. If you want that fuel thing to be a little bit bigger, we can make it bigger. Let me know. I'll put that, that lap thing as well. Flags. There you go. Put that there. If you want it a little bit bigger. Oh, spar's cut out as well. Spar up there. Fuel is fine. Thank you. Thank you, Terence. Thank you, mate. Enjoy the rest of your day, dude. Let's reduce the fuel. I'll put it down to about 50. Right, untick the tyres. Like I said, good practice for Saturday. Ah, <laughs> yes, and you don't need one of those, mate. Even David, even Michael, thanks everyone for joining me. Um, as always, YouTuber thing, first time I've said it, but if you are enjoying, please do consider hitting the like button. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Maybe subscribe as well. I've changed it. I think subscribes pop up the on the screen. Temp is now, so. 22 Celsius. The air temp is 21 Celsius. I think. Don't quote me on that. Follow car number 13. Thank you, Donut. Then black stuff, I'll try to, Ingo. You know me, mate. I'll do my best. Thanks, David. Yeah, it's nice to be back. Thanks, Sean. Do I change brake bias during the race, Ollie? Awful, of course. No, I don't. I never change the brake bias. And very much, I always say this, like any setting, any second setting at all to do with feedback, steering angle, anything, brake bias, I do not touch it. I just adjust to whatever I'm given. I feel like as soon as you start adjusting that stuff, you'll ne it will never feel right. So I just keep it as is. Heads up, we're going green. Hello, Dino. All right, time to concentrate now. Oh. oh god. Oh yeah, I could see that coming. You could see that coming a mile off, couldn't you? Six has gone off in as you came. Goodness me. <laughs> oh wow. How have we got away with that? On your left. Clear left. Come on, lads. Sort it out. Well done, Oliver. Good start. left. He's still there. Oh, he's going to go free wide on the first lap. Car left. Whoa. Car left. Don't rejoin on that. Clear. Oh, that. <laughs> oh, it's a big crash in the back. Goodness me. <laughs> Lovely start, lads. Goodness me. What was that? That was one of the scariest starts I've ever done. I think we did well to avoid all the carnage, to be honest. We get our head down and just concentrate. Josh sent me a uh, picture of all the times that he's been doing. 
So he's been practicing in these like constantly in the 201s. Yeah, it's a lot of time in there. Hey, fatty. <laughs> Playing old Jeff, roger that, mate. If you lock up in these things here, by the way, it's a world of pain. Oh, some P5. Slipstream's very strong. I knew he was going to defend that. Back off. Play some fuel. No alternative views. Just like just a uh, cockpit. Is a sim after all. It's quicker, quicker through this middle sector. Gained a lot of time on me. Find out what I'm doing wrong there. Gain two times to me there. Yeah. It's very quick in the middle sector. Run less downforce, maybe. More downforce, I should say. Hmm. Cheers, Carl, mate. Not so good coming out of the corner this time. Tenth off the pace in sectors one and three. Sector two is 0.6 off the pace. Uh, Mattia Cassini, XGP250 runners behind. Oh, awesome! That's cool. Nice spot. This guy in front of me is breaking. Breaking away from me. Oh, Walter. I'm running too wide there. All right, Oliver. Don't be intimidated by this little shit. Make him work for it. Yeah, it might have some damage. It shouldn't be too much, though. I did get a times four earlier. And it's kind of nice when you follow people like this, especially when you've got like a lack of practice. It just helps you get up to speed immediately. I find. Head up three tenths and him down the straight. Yeah, I think they're we're still in that slipstream range, is probably why. A very long straight. Well, Incident in La Source. We think it might be Herriera. Oh, well, who's that? Is that P1 and P2 have come together? Oh, my goodness. That is, isn't it? Oh, wow. <laughs> well, that's two positions right there, boys and girls. Wow. As if they've come together there.
Can't quite believe that. Yeah, so we've all gone up a position then, or two I should say. So one across the line should be P5. tail out there. Go behind me looks quick as well, old Paul. Really nice through there. Might struggle a little bit more now because our friend Walter is in the slipstream of Lars. We're not going to gain him in anymore in the straights. Only he's going to pull away from us now. It's a shame. And then pulls a lot Thank closer. You all the work. Focus on your exits. will open after 15 minutes. It should close at about 38 minutes. I'll tell you what, Lars knows what he's doing in that LMP2. Desperately just trying to stay in the slipstream range here. Oh, he went there. Do you see that? Oh, he's under pressure now. Oh, he's lost it from Lars. Oh. Hey, Jamie. Right, I kind of want to get in the suck at the right moment. This looks about right, I think. Is the gap behind is now zero, but three zero. Right, next up, our friend Lars. Our boy.
Okay, Sean. Lap time was 203.10. That's good consistency. Keep it up. There's a faster class car behind. Okay. Nine tenths is the gap to the guy behind me. Should be plenty. And then P1's approaching. It's not cost me too much time. Oh, truck will understeer. That yeah, maybe I don't know. P7 in their class then, so he's had a bit of a stink of that LMP1. He's not had a good day of it. It's just... That little, um... Instant, just at the end of the... Kemmel straight, where it ever took me. It just lost... Like, three temps then. It just... Just caused our boy uh, Walter to really get in the optimal suckage range. Better. Six temps. Okay, Oliver. Don't let this guy distract you. Behind me, smart. Oh, blimey. Good time in ending it. Well, Lars has moved up to P2. Right, the original P2's made a mistake somewhere. through there. Yeah, Lars is on fire here. Really well now, up to P2. Can he catch up to P1? That's the question. The issue he's got. So he's got that chap right behind him who's got the slip. That's been really difficult to break him. Jack, whoa, Jack! Car, car right, car right. Whoa, I didn't like that. Thinking like a man, man. Oh no. Well, this is awkward, isn't it? 
Left side, clear left. Hold your nerve, make them do the work. There we go. Last car approaching. Mm, no You're pulling away. The gap behind is now 0.8. Mm. Can't be far away from the GTEs, I don't think. Yeah, 14 seconds. Right side, clear right. A little bit of suckage, please. Thank you very much. It's a lot of suckage, actually. Suck, suck, suck. Yummy. Oh, perfect. That was a perfect suck through there. Thank you very much. P8 of the LMP uh, ones there. Zinky. Zinky very much. That's half fuel. You've used half your fuel. Lap so far, this one. Blue flag. Oh, please don't ruin it. Oh, that's P1. What the? F <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Blue flag. Oh god! <laughs> oh god! I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness me! Oh, that's, that's a big rip! Oi, oh, chat, we got whatever, whatever that manage you got. <laughs> you got to remember. Lap 10, lap 10, we got to look at that. Oh, goodness me. Well, Lars has said sorry, why has he said sorry? Oh god, this is all kicking off. Oh boy. Get this guy, unfortunately. Coming up on a slower class car. Car left. Clear left. On your left, clear left. Absolutely nothing you can do here, you just gotta wait. Right. Nothing you can do. Right side's clear. Behind is now 0.8. Thankfully, the guy behind me has had the same sort of issue. Multi class racing, you've got to love it. There's an incident. Oh! Campus. Who's that? Oh, it's P2 for the MP1s! Oh, F.
Can I just say, we started P10 in this, we're P4 now. This is going pretty good. Alright, where am I going to catch Harry in this Porsche? Okay, Oliver. Slower cars ahead. These guys will be fighting for position. They might not see you. Okay, this should be pretty good, to be honest. Very nice line, Porsche. On your right. Good boy. Clear right. Car right. Right side's clear. A little bit sketchy around there. You're coming upon some slower cars. These guys are busy fighting, they might not notice you. Oh, You're oh a lot I'm guy catching a lot on P3 here. Wow. Oh, look, he's there, look, he's there. Goodness, he's had a hellish time. Well, clear great. left. Lock the car left. Clear left. Car left. Still there. Clear left. Woo! Nice. Dispatch those of them quite well. Left side. Clear left. Nice. Left side. Cut through them beautifully. 1.6 to P3. Oh, this guy's pretty quick, though. It'll be really tough. That lap was a 204.92. good spot with the guy behind me yet. Yeah. Not wrong, we do have some breathing room now. Ah, it's gone wide. Silly. Tim's last was this... 6.8, yeah, he got held up by those GTs so badly. So bad. The gap in front is now 1.7 seconds. I think we can catch him. I've just got to nail every single lap. It's got to be personal best, personal best. Slow car ahead. This guy's their class leader. I think it was much point dive bombing in there. 48 refuel at the moment, thank you.
You like the map hide? Oh, cool. How'd you like it, mate? Now 1.3. Right, if you wouldn't mind, chat, if you could just, when he crosses the line, now update, if you could tell me his lap time, please, I appreciate it, thank you. I feel like we're going to do identical times here. Sector 1 is 0.48 of the pace. <laughs> 2027. Okay, thank you. Damn. There's me thinking I caught him last lap. Thank you, everyone. Okay, Oliver, we're at the halfway point. We think about nine minutes of fuel remaining. This guy's quick. The gap ahead is now 1.4. Okay, we're two tenths up. And it's still 1.4. It's like identical at the moment. An undercut. I'll, I'll, burning us. I'll keep. I'll keep an eye on the gap between the cars around us. If we're coming up to another group of, like GTS or something, I may consider that. At the moment, we've got clean air, so there's no reason left for me side. to do that. Clear left. You're matching race pace. This is good. Go to six. That felt like a good lap time there. Really good. Bars is only three seconds behind P1. Yeah, he is, yeah. P1 just gained a load of time there. I don't know how. Tim just gained a load of time as well. How's that work? He did a 2023. Jeez. What the hell? Fair play, he's killing it. He's absolutely killing it. The Benson's in the chat, hello, mate. I'll take it, we'll take it. Stay between the lines, please, Oliver. Yes, yes. Now. 1.6 seconds.
pretty much in the curb there, I think. What car are we using for the six hour? Uh, we're using the LMP2. Yourself. Second gear for that one. You're gaining on this car. The gap is 1.3 seconds. I mean, are we just following this guy or what? I mean, goodness me. 1.4 seconds, about half an hour it feels. Oh, that was terrible. Ah, oh, I lost two temps there. Silly. You've just done a 202.86. Very little fuel left in this lap. Box this lap. Thanks for that, Jim. I don't think the undercut would work because I'm in clean air right now. I wouldn't know where I'd come out. Plus, it'll put me on heavier fuel. I'm on really light fuel right now, so my best pace is now. 47.9. Thanks, everyone. Gay coming out of there. I lost speed in the exit as well because of it. The leader is pitting now. We think P3 has gone off in the chicane. He hasn't. Pit lane speed limit Jim is right 60 him, kilometers per hour. Watch your speed limit in the pits. Okay, here he is. The car behind is pitting. 100 meters. 50 meters. Come on, here we go. I think so, Connor. Seems to be good. It's clear. Don't cross the white line. 
Tim's on the field there. Not sure by how much. He's going to second on me there. I think he's on the field. He's planned to fuel save during this stint. Looks like in the morning, Josh will be double stinting the tyres. The gap ahead is now 2.9. Time for there for some reason. Oh yeah, Josh, mate. Out of curiosity, we're doing this at the weekend. How much does the track temperature actually increase? Stay focused. We're still in this. That's 20 minutes to Since go. This is the start of the race. Does anyone actually know? Has it increased at all? I don't, think, I don't think Jim's told me. He hasn't mentioned anything about track temperature. I don't think. Woo. Up by two degrees. Oh, cheers. Front is now 2.8. Silly off tracks at the moment. Okay, Oliver, we've run out of track limits. Keep it between the lines. I'm trying, just pushing. Steady again at 2.7. The track temperature is increasing. It's now 24 Celsius. There we go. There he comes at the 24. Ah, kicked in a little bit there. 2.2 has made a mistake there.
Difficult to catch the sky at the moment. Gap in front is now 2.2. I get back in the 202s, but I'm finding it quite difficult right now. I'm a bit high wear, high attempts as well. Okay, Oliver, there's a car exit in the pit. Heads yeah. up. Good consistency. Keep them coming. Cheers, Jim. Better out there. Over 200 likes. Thanks, everyone. As always, please do consider hitting the like button if you are enjoying what you're seeing. Maybe subscribe as well. Welcome along. A few seconds. 15 minutes left. Thanks, Chris. Thank you very much, mate. I'll do my best, buddy. 15 minutes left. Damn, son. Where'd you find this? This guy, the gap's now 1.7. See how kind those GTEs are going to be to me, if, if at all any. Oh, they have been kind. They have been very kind indeed. The class leader from a faster class is behind. Slower class car ahead. Blue flag. Oh no, I'm going to I'm gonna catch a Blanchemont, I think. Oh no, 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 no. Ah, Sugar! There's an incident in the chicane. Car right. Right side's clear. Oh no. Oh, he's... No, 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 no. We didn't need that. Car right. Ah. Clear right. Oh, we didn't need that chat. Right side's clear. Come on, Brian, go, go, go. Don't hold up. Just keep going, keep going, mate, keep going. Looks like P6 has gone off in La Source. Car right. Hold your line. Clear right. Man, thank you. Hey Chris. The gap in front is now two point zero. Okay, Oliver, there's a faster car approaching. Guys, it's difficult to catch this guy, man. Blue flag. He's doing really well. in chat as well. Hello, mate. That's a bit better. Faster car approaching. Coming up left side. Right. Clear left. Point three now. That 
last lap was a 202.92. Jesus! Car left. Clear left. We just cut the track. Oh, I know, Jim. Jim, I know. The gap ahead is now 1.3 seconds. Hello. Finally caught up, but would I have been it basic holly style? Oh, I'm starting to get a dirty air understeer. Oh, that's horrible. Slower class car ahead. Done over by that GTE. Pay attention to track limits. Please oh, I don't really care at the moment, Jim. I just want to try and get a podium, baby. Ten minutes remaining. Ten minutes. Left side. Clear left. I wonder how much he's done that on purpose. Car left. Clear left. Good stuff, mate. This is fucking excellent. P3. Cheers, Jim. Left side. Clear left. Jim's absolutely pleased with my work. He did under fuel, remember, to get a gap on me. So I wonder if he's, if he's backed off a little bit. Stick behind me, save some fuel, and then go for it again. Make the bastard work for it. Slower class car ahead. Well, Adams. Adams has been it. Boy, he's had a nightmare. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, Adams. Oh, F. Oh, well, that's an F. Oh, this is a gigantic, gigantic F. Oh, no. no. Right, clear right. Fucking hell, mate! Christ, Tim, you trying to kill us? Car left. Clear left. Woo! On your left. Backed off. Fair play. Clear left. The gap oh. ahead is increasing. It's now 7.2. There's an incident in the chicane. Yeah. Now, People dead. 2.7, isn't it? That lap was a 204.78. I'm hoping all things go well. That should be enough of a gap. <laughs> Cheers, Chris. Appreciate that, my guy. One crash that you came. Okay. Yeah, I think it was the uh, LMP1 drive in front of me, P5. Uh, Lars had incredible pace. We haven't got the time to catch him. So I think if we do if we do catch Lars, it will only be because he's made a mistake. Doesn't mean we won't keep trying though.
Yeah, that Adams guy, last the LMP2s, he's... Oh, he's having a stinker. An absolute rotter. Yeah, Lars is doing very well. And Tim's back on the pace. Three laps left, chat, I reckon. What Joe say? Five minutes to go. You're looking good for a podium. Caught Lars a lot there. Hopefully he just got caught behind uh, Andrew Dawson. What's your thoughts on this race in chat? What do you think of LMP2 cars at Spa? Do you like it? Do you prefer GTEs here? What are your thoughts? Slower car ahead. He's the class leader for these guys. Pretty tasty. Most places would be good. Alright. Andrew, I don't want to mess your race up, mate. There we go. There's an incident in the chicane. It looks like it's Adams. Love the sound. Great, great, great. Awesome. Glad you're all enjoying it. Just so happy we could just do one of these races again, not have to worry about <laughs> the internet or anything like that. Computer crashing is so far. Fingers crossed. This has been, uh, yeah, it's actually been a faultless stream for once. First one this week, which is really, really, really awesome. Yes, yeah, this track is just brilliant, isn't it? I really do think it's great for multi-class racing. You can't really get floor damage either in the LMP2, which is great. Obviously a big worry for these things. I don't know if there's going to be a white flag or not. We'll see. Good luck, this one. Not yet.
No, I haven't got the in-game um, chat turned on, though. No. Never really used it. You have to map a button to mute, uh, to talk. Funny thing is, we are catching Lars, aren't we? <laughs> well, that's not just me. I think we are catching Lars. I think we're just running out of time, sadly. Hey, Michael. Yeah, mate, thanks for joining. We estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. white flag kept Tim at bay which is good we're running on fumes mate okay Oliver one more to go keep it together we'll be on the podium your lap times are improving this is good cheers Jim the white flag uh, you just can't see it sorry everyone it's behind the uh, you think P5 behind has been standards in it. Source. P5 actually been there Oh, they have. Oh, F. If they, if Lars under fueled, it won't have been by much because I was only point one off doing an extra lap. So there will be people who have slightly under fueled. Six. I think we've managed the uh, tire wear pretty well here. So we seem to be gaining on, uh, on Lars quite a bit here. Check my lap, lap. Check my lap. 26. What the fuck happened there? Just used. That's two minutes left. Two minutes. Right, here we go then, boys and girls. Incident in La Source. Oh. There you go. That was an hour of racing. How quick did that fly by? We're on the podium. Exactly, Good David. Drive. Oh, P3. I'll take that. I will take that. Class. Hello, buddy. Oh, that's not Lars. That's uh, Lorenz. Oh, good race. Good race in the end. I'll oh, take a P3. I really will. Four. Thank you, everyone. P3 in the end. Really, really happy with that. I don't know what, I, what was our fastest lap in the end? 2.026. The 2.026 for me. What was Lars' fast lap? 2.025. That guy in P1. Two, two, three. Wow, okay, you definitely deserve it. Good job. Oh, good job for you, Lars, mate. Really good. Really happy. We started in P10. Started in P10, so thanks, everyone. Um, lap 10, wasn't it? You want to see what happened to that Porsche, everyone? Let's have a look. Uh, laps. Uh, lap 10. Let's have a little gander, shall we? I'm really chuffed. P10 to P3. 
Awesome. Oh, there it is. Right off thank you for the 899. Well done, chat. Cracking hour racing. Thank you very much, my guy. Thank you. Damn, Thank you, Chris, as well, son, for another Fortnite time. Nice yes. one. Cheers. Thank you, dude. Thank you both very much. Thank you very, very much indeed. Awesome. Thanks, everyone. But let's have a look. There's, there's that poor Porsche. Oh! Damn, oh, son, God! Where'd you find this? Oh, God! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> so I think he just got—he just got absolutely sent, didn't he? Oh no! Oh, that is horrible! Oh my god! Oh goodness me! Oh, that's gotta suck. Jeez. I'm, I d what do we think here? What do you think? Who's at, do you think anyone's at fault here? I get the feeling, right? Um, I might just... My, my theory on this... I, f I don't know why this LMP2 car slows down on the Apex. Watch this. That's a flat out corner. That's a, that's a flat out corner. Even if it's a slight bit of net code, I don't know why he's great. Are you, are you, what do you think chat? I don't, I don't get why this guy's braked. Cause it is completely flat. Even with these guys up ahead, he would have been fine. Look, he's got loads of space. Takes that guy out and then, do you know what I mean? I think, I think he panicked. I think you're right. I think you're right. Um, let's um, have a quick look at uh, the... Uh, have a look. Uh, where am I at this point? Here I am. So I just come through here and they look. No, it wasn't Lars. No, that was Tim. Uh, and then someone said about lap one, didn't you? Let's go back to the start. Oh, goodness me. Amazingly, I didn't get any damage from that, any optionals. Okay, so let's, let's quickly review this then, shall we? Okay, so I'm taking note of this guy up here. This guy's gone for a move on there. He gets it done, but this guy's going very slowly. He can't, he starts to break to, you know, react to it. And this guy's got no chance. And they ends up taking him out. I don't know. Oof, Lars was close there to get taken out on that one. I feel for this guy. I really feel for him on this one. I think this guy's just trying to take a cautious approach to the start of the race. Ah, just gets yeeted, doesn't he? Okay. Uh, it was this guy here, wasn't it? He just makes a good start and naturally goes for the move and gets it done. Oh, I think... I think that's... I think that's Paul Chat. What do you think? This guy's gone for the move. Um, it's just not reacted quick enough, I don't think. I don't know, it's very tough. Very tough at the start. It's so difficult to get that right. Um, and, then, and then he's just not seen that one on the inside of that corner. And, uh, yeah... Be fair, I didn't really turn enough, I don't think, there either, so. Could have done a little bit better myself, to be honest. What was that? Who was that guy that said about lap 25? Reduced. Let's have a look. Oh, he said about lap 25. What's he talking about? Is 
See what he says. Now he said 26 and he went at 25, sorry. What? I don't, I don't know why he's... Lap time was fine. I know. Well, he said 26 and then, and then he says 25. Uh, oh, 26. Apologies. No, it is 26. God damn it. There's this lap then. I mean, 26, 25, 26. Better be worth it, Juiced. Oh, wow. What the hell was that? Bro. <laughs> What's he doing? What's he doing? Oh, Matt, Max has had a stinker there. Look at this. He, he genuinely thought he could go for that. There is net code. There is net code, but... Oh. <laughs> oh, God. Anything else happened to him? Poor sod. He's right near the end of the race as well, I think. Yeah, he only had one lap left after that. He's done well to keep keep going there. He's done very well. Wow. Jeez. Net code. It is net code, but at the same time, even without net code, that was scary. It was lap twelve turn eight? What happened on lap twelve turn eight? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. So this is where we're going past all the lap cars here. The dispatch one, the dispatch two, the dispatch three. That's how it's done, by the way. The space we gave each other there, much better. Yeah. That was quite important that we got that one done. Can you check end of lap two, P1, P2? Oh, yes! That's a very, very good point. Must be this one then. What lap did P1 and P2? Oh, wow, I've just seen it. I have just seen it. So this is P1 and P2, chat. I think that might be a murder. Oh, my God. What the f fuck? All right, just to give you an FYI, every time I've braked, every time I've braked, right, I've braked here. Just at the end of this side, you can see the dirt. So this guy brakes at that point, stops braking. That was completely and utterly on purpose. That is completely and utterly on purpose. There's no doubt in my mind. Brakes. He's going to get reported for that. That guy's car's destroyed. Why has he done that? Whoa. So, what, what, I don't understand why he's done it. Look, they, they, they've not... No bad blood, previous lap. I did... I... I don't get it. I don't get it, why is it... I... 
I really don't get it. Ants on the post postcard. Nick Adams as well. He had an absolute stinker, didn't he? Oh. He had an absolute stinker. It's half, it's half 11, chat. Jesus. Half 11. Crikey. Ah. <sighs> Pedal malfunction, maybe. I don't know. Uh, for me, for me, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't think so. I don't, I don't think so. Let's, if you have a look at his brakes, look. So he's braking there. He's braking early enough, and then he just lets go. But this is not. And then it, and then it comes back on again. It, it comes back on again. For me, that is 100% deliberate. But I have no idea why he's done it. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I hope that guy reports him. Uh, I hope he reports him for that, because that is... <laughs> it's about as blatant as it gets. Check lap, lap one after the Kemmel straight. What, what am I checking after the Kemmel straight, my guy? This is yeah, it's literally like F1 highlights, isn't it? Someone said it. After the Kemmel straight. What happened after the Kemmel straight? Oh, yeah, that was free wide, wasn't it? <laughs> I bet this, this would have looked good on TV. Let's have a look at the TV. Oh, yeah. Oh! oh. <laughs> What's going on in this race? Goodness! Oh, Jack's got absolutely yeeted. Sorry, chat. I'll, I'll end this stream soon. <laughs> I just want to watch. I just want to see what happened. Here. Oh, he got yeeted. He got yeeted. He rejoins. Oh! He gets yeeted again. Oh. <laughs> Up in his arse, then. Oh, goodness me. Oh, that's Nick Adams. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, goodness me. Well, that, that's well, <laughs> what a good way to end it. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining. Um, means a lot to me that you guys still kept coming along to these, even though uh, it's been a bad week in terms of, you know, streaming. So I really do appreciate it. P3 in the end in that one as well. Um, so, yeah, good comeback in the first one. Moved a few, few positions in this one as well. But uh, thank you very much for uh, sticking around me. Uh, I really hope you enjoyed it. Uh, we're doing this a lot more. Tuesdays, Thursdays and weekends for iRacing stuff. So um, thanks very much, everyone. Um, Take care, and I'll see you hopefully Saturday morning, 8 a.m. Um, BST for uh, Six Hours of Spa. So, um, fingers crossed, we'll see you there, and I'll uh, yeah catch you for the next one. Uh, let's see if this outro works, shall we? Take care. Ta-da.